Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Two Phones back again with another informative video. This video is going to be um, doing speed tests and interactions with the Google and um, service. Now you can only get the Google uh, well, I don't think you necessarily can just get it with the Google Fi service. If you got a Pixel, a Nexus, a Motorola, I think it automatically comes with it once you connect to a, um, you know, a, a secured Wi-Fi hotspot that's um, partnered with Google. So like any Wi-Fi hotspot in the area uh, Google has partnered with, you will get the key and the G on top of the key, let you know that, hey, you're using the Google's um, protected Wi-Fi connection VPN. All right, so no further ado, we're going I'm going to show you um, the IP address. Let's go to the Chrome browser. Okay, now this is the main website you want to use is what is my IP address, and it will let you know exactly um, the coordinates, exactly the network, um, the the host name, the, AN, the ASN, the ISP, the organization, the service, the type, all that. What country you in, all that, all right? So, um, yeah, it's going to show you the location. Uh, on the map and things and that sort of like that. Once again, like I said, I am using the VPN. It's not really covering, showing my actual location. So if you want to hide your location, for use this website. And I'll put the link in the description box. All right, so this is how you know. All right, so no further ado, let's go ahead and exit out of that. Let's go ahead and run a speed test over Wi-Fi connection. All right, so here we are, we're gonna do the speed test. So I'm going to show you how well it runs on a VPN. It's showing um, the server is in Kansas when using Google Fiber connection over the VPN. All right, let's go. Wow, it's not doing really bad at all. I mean, it's not doing bad at all. This is Google. This is Google's. Google VPN is actually doing better than AT and T. Wow. Okay. Uh, uploads is about the same. The uploads, I, I don't get the uploads, but it seems like both VPNs are doing the same. Now, once again, guys, this this connection is over Wi-Fi. This is not using mobile data, and that's what the speed we're going to do next. All right. So let's try one more speed test with the Wi-Fi. Okay, 99, well, it says it's on 100. Okay. And the pings aren't bad either. Pings is 35, so. Good with tape. All right, look at them uploads. Look at them. Come on, 11. I see 11. Yes. Yes, well, wait, wait. we right on par with just Spectrum Internet. So, this just lets you know. All right, so it's nothing too drastic change there. Let's exit out real quick. Um, matter of fact, let me go ahead and close that out. Uh, yeah, there we go. So here we go. Let's scroll down a little bit. Let's turn off the Wi-Fi. Let's see what it does on the data connection. Now I am in a different room to do this data speed test over VPN. So um, let's just see how well it does. Let's go back to the Chrome browser. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and okay, update it. And it's showing the same coordinates. So it's still being legitimate. All right. So this lets you know it's still legitimate. All right. So no further ado. Let's go back to the speed test application. Let's open that up. All right. Here we go. Now this is on the Pixel 3a XL. I'm using the Pixel 3a XL. This was running Snapdragon uh, 670. Once again, the processors the uh, the speeds, the networks, they all are going to be different for everyone. So just keep this in mind. You might not get the same amount of speeds as me. You might get it higher, you might get it lower. This is just on devices I'm using with the VPN coordinates, VPN networks and everything. So no further ado, let's just go ahead and give this a go.
Now I'm gonna let you guys know this is over a VPN and Google's VPN using um I think I'm on the uh tower. So I think I'm on the T-Mobile Tower right now. So it then once again, guys, this all varies. You can't be mad. It's your location. It's your server. It's the server you choose. It's the location. All right. So it just depends on if you trust the VPN or if you don't. <laughs> or you trust the network or you don't. All right. If it's worth the money or if it's not. All right. So <laughs> this is what you guys got to realize. A lot of people saying this, saying that. It is what it is. I'm just giving you guys my experience. This is my experience on the devices I own, the devices I use, the networks I use, the, the, the city and areas and everything like that. So this is why we got to do these tests, people. So let's go. One more time. Let's see what we got. Now, these speeds right now are in my living room. I'm uh, not living room, but then, and like I said, it should be running on that T-Mobile network using the Pixel 3a XL with Google Fi and a VPN. All right. So you guys want to use the VPN. This is what you should be expecting. Okay. All right, we're going to try one more because, like I said, I'm not going to be using up all this data anyway. It's the Google data, but I'm on the VPN because you want to be safe and secure. And then we're going to video, view, view, uh, video footage. All right, here we go. Okay, got a little higher that time. Let's see if we can get them uploads up. Try to shoot over six. Six or seven. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we got six. Hey, man. All right, so this is what we're getting using Google Files on top of whatever network we got. Um, Let's see. Let's just go ahead and see which network we're running on. Sigma Spy. Huh. Yeah, uh, see, I think the thing is, it's, okay, okay. It changed the T-Mobile. It was showing Sprint. It changed the T-Mobile. So there you have it. Um, according to them, I got two bars. Now, once again, guys, when you see that, that number, 111 minus 111, that's actually bad. That's that's actually bad. Anything over a, a, a negative 100, it's not good. Okay, so you want to be under 100 to have good speeds and good service and stuff like that. So the location, the room I'm in right now, is not a good place to be using it. But no further ado, let's just go ahead and uh, check out a YouTube video. Let's see what the YouTube video does. All right. Okay, so let me just try that one. Let's play that one. Siri! 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 Dad? Siri! Dad? Siri! Dad? Dad? Siri! Dad? Siri! I'm talking to you! Siri! Dad? It's stupid, kid. This doesn't work. All right, as you can see, the video plays fine even on 480p or 1080p once again ladies and gentlemen must i remind you when you're doing it watching videos make sure you want to have the highest capacity uh resolution of the video um if you don't mind using up all the data if you got fully unlimited data then you need to be on that 1440p or the 1080p or the 720p I mean, there's no no one should be on the phone with 480p resolution. I'm sorry. Um, this is 2019. You got to step your game up. <laughs> so I'm just saying. But at the same time, uh, let me know y'all thoughts on the Google Files. Access. Um, check out that website. What is my um, IP address? 
Uh, it will let you know exactly. Once again, I was just showing you guys over VPN connection that it was showing me the actual server and connectivity and network that the VPN was running on. All right, man. Once again, this is another VPN review. Um, if you guys like my VPN reviews, please subscribe, share this video, hit, hit the thumbs up, and check me out later. All right.